to succeed at this thing. What the- this this thing you're trying to do, you've got to stop being so damn deferential. I can't help being deferential. It's built in. Then change. Change. I have changed. I don't mean on the outside. Change on the inside. Take chances. Make mistakes. Mistakes? Yes. Sometimes it's important not to be perfect. Okay? It's important to do the wrong thing. Do the wrong thing? Yes. Why? Oh, I see. To learn from your mistakes. No, to make them. To find out what's real and what's not. To find out what you feel. Human beings are terrible messes, Andrew. I'll grant you that. I see. This is what is known as an irrational conversation, isn't it? No, this is a human conversation. It's not about being rational. It's about following your heart. And that's what I should do. Yes. And you have a heart, Andrew. You do. I feel it. I don't even believe it sometimes, but I do feel it. And in order to follow that heart, one must do the wrong thing. Yes. Thank you.
Roshan. I have done everything inside and out. That stuff doesn't matter to me. Well, something matters, because I have to believe if nothing mattered, you'd love me and not some man whose chin could sink the Titanic. What? See? It's true, isn't it? I'm sorry. Does he light you up like this? Does he make you laugh? No, but he makes me laugh. Good. Then admit it. Admit that you love me. Give me one kiss. So, one quick kiss. Just one kiss could not jeopardize a glorious marriage. Besides, it would also explain to me why your pulse has just jumped from 66 to 102 beats per minute. Your respiration rate is doubled. You're putting out clouds of pheromones, Portia. It's not fair to read me like that. I know, love isn't fair. I'm reading your heart. I'm asking you to follow it. Begging you. Begging is supposed to be humiliating, but I don't care. I love you, Portia. I loved you the very first moment I saw you.